So my dudes of Hulk here, today I'm going to be talking to you about the new weapon banner. Is it any good? Is it any bad? Is it Pong? Is it Wog? Is it whatever? <laughs> I'm going to be talking to you about the new weapon banner. If you guys don't know what the new weapon banner features, it features both Millennial Movement Weaponry as well as some sacrificial weapons for a 4 star. But most importantly, those Millennial Movement Weapons. The weapons that are a mouthful both in name and passive. You have Broken Pines and Freedom Sworn Sword. Both of them do virtually the same thing, the Millennial Movement Weapons. Um, lose super long passes. There's one thing to keep in mind if you're summoning for these weapons is similar effects from the Millennial Movement Passive does not stack. For example, the plus 20% attack that all of them give does not stack, but everything else does. For example, with Broken Pines, whenever you activate the Millennial Movement effect, it gives you attack speed. So the attack speed will actually stack alongside the 20% attack buff and alongside the normal and charge attack damage that Freedom Sworn Sworn gives. So basically these are both very very powerful weapons that if you really want it's it's a good weapon banner but as always I never recommend free to play someone on a weapon banner. This is more my advice to the dolphins and the uh, small spenders. Uh, my real advice is don't spend anything at all. You, you can make perfect do with 4 star weapons. There's nothing wrong with it. And uh, you're perfectly fine just not ever summoning for a 5 star weapon, but you know. You do you, boo boo, I'm not your boss. If you want those shiny new toys, then go and get them. <laughs> but anyways, that's basically it for the weapon banner. It's not a whole lot. Thank you guys for watching, as always. Super short video today. I'll catch you guys in the next one. Peace.